An exciting moment here tonight as finally we will settle some scores. The WWE Universe is extremely excited as we get set for WWE action. Tonight we find out if you reach the... from New York. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. Here we go, fellas. I've been looking forward to this one for quite some time. Well done. Right to the face. Clearly on a mission here. From what we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. Just an unforgiving slam. You have to think that's it. Ooh. Oh, and a stomp. Just despicable menacing. Punishing the human body. There's a devastating springboard Swiss uppercut. That packed a punch. What a stop to the back of the neck. This is what makes him one of the best in the Jeez. business. attack on the body. Uh, I think this is... Oh, boy. The RKO. That has got to be... Digging deep for a kick out. Wow, I am impressed. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. That's 
that's how you move up the ladder here in WWE. The clothesline finds the mark. The human body can only absorb so much of that. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. When this guy's on, look out. Things are not looking very good right now. Going to have to find a way to regroup. Offense like this is exactly how a competitor takes control of a match. One move after the other. It's devastating. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. Warm up the bus. This one is over. Going for the cover. There's no coming back from that. A minor miracle might be needed to overcome this beating. Talk about having the living hell beat out of you. I think this one's over. Nice job getting out of the way of that one. Done. He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh boy, he is ready. And there's a stiff uppercut. At this point, it looks like even the winner of this match will walk out of here beaten and battered. I really can't believe what's gone down so far. This match has been even more physical than I thought it would be. Big move coming! Well, this is a level of destruction no one was expecting. This one's over, guys! Oh, how resilient was that? Still in it. What a gutsy performance. We're witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as severe.
Definitely not where you want to be right now. Gotta find a way to get out of this, Michael. That's it. It's over. It's over. Here's a cover. And now we're just moments away from this huge fatal four-way match. You're absolutely right, Michael. This match is huge. And from talking to some of the superstars earlier today, I'm willing to bet the monitors in the back are sold out for this one. North Carolina, weighing in at 220 pounds, the unpredictable Ryan Bourne. Guys, we have four of WWE's biggest names set to do battle here tonight. And Michael, I can realistically see any one of these four superstars winning this match, which is what makes this match so unpredictable. Fatal four-way action coming up in Byron. What should we look out for in this one? This is one of those matches, Michael, where anything can happen, and it usually does. The only thing I know for sure is that the referee will have his hands full in this one. The four men in the ring are set. One of the most chaotic contests a superstar can compete in is a fatal four-way. Anything can happen, and the match can be over in an instant. One thing to keep an eye out for in a match like this is the formation of alliances. When that happens, you want to make sure you're not on the wrong end of it. Otherwise, you're not going to end in a hurry. Nice 
nicely executed. To the back of the neck, Scottish Sicker. from this. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. Ooh! This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. The Fatal 4-Way match works like this. Four superstars are in the ring all at once. There are no count outs and no disqualifications. You have four superstars who are throwing down in the ring all at the same time, and they can fight anywhere they want to. It's mass hysteria. Corey, you talked about the ground rules of a fatal four-way match. One thing to keep in mind is that depending on the stipulation, there could be eliminations in the match, meaning that once a superstar is pinned, taps out, is counted out, or is disqualified, they are eliminated from the match. But the battle wages on. And a stipulation can change the entire complexion of a match. As one may think, a fatal four-way can see an interesting breakdown of temporary allies. No count outs and no disqualifications means anything can happen and it can happen anywhere. Executed perfectly. It's gotta be hard to rebound from that one. Stationary position, turns around. Well, extremely effective splash there. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh boy, he is rolling. Many times in a Fatal 4-Way match, we've seen superstars join forces for the moment and taking out a dominant entity. This could be someone like Big Show. Uh, I think this is the beginning of That's how you move up the ladder here in WWE. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. And the shoulder's up in time. How in the world? Byron, you made an excellent point a few moments ago. There have been many times throughout history where superstars have joined forces in a fatal four-way match in hopes of eliminating by pinning or incapacitating that dominant force. Sometimes interesting alliances are formed. We saw that at the 33rd WrestleMania during the Raw Women's Championship match. We sure did, Michael. Nia Jax dominated Charlotte Flair, Bayley, and the boss, Sasha Banks, in the early going. While they recovered out on the floor, they realized for that moment they were stronger together. The decorated champion... When I talk about Fatal 4 matches, I always think back to the classic battle at Backlash 2007 between Shawn Michaels, John Cena, Randy Orton, and the rated R superstar Edge. The action was so fast and furious from the get-go, it served as a prime example of why a superstar needs eyes in the back of their head in a Fatal 4-Way match. Byron, earlier you mentioned one of the classic fatal four-way confrontations in sports entertainment history. The match between John Cena, Edge, Shawn Michaels, and Randy Orton for the WWE Championship was a highly anticipated main event. The match saw a temporary reunion of the rated RK. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top row. You have to possess a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. Here. Well executed. That has got to be it. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. Wow, what's it going to take? One move after the other. It's devastating.
The human body can only absorb so much of that. Big time slam right there. Ah, oh, drop kick to the spine. When this guy's on, look out. Here's a cover! The be it. One! And the fight must go on. Too early in the match to end it. Incredible striking combo. Since there are no disqualifications in a fatal four-way match, a superstar has to be aware of the fact that if they're in an elimination fatal four-way match, someone who was eliminated can come back for retribution, and it's all legal. So you can eliminate an opponent, and they can interfere in the match later, and there's nothing anyone can do about it. Lands a pretty stiff kick. Myron, you touched on something earlier that's worth repeating. If you're a superstar competing in a fatal four-way elimination match and a competitor is eliminated, they can look to settle a score and affect the outcome of the match later. That's always a possibility in a fatal four-way match because of the no disqualification stipulation. Michael, that's what I like to call an occupational hazard. We saw an example of that in 2016 during the fatal four-way elimination match to determine the number one can... Uh, I think this... I'll be shocked if that's not it. This is all but over. Now Pat a plan and executed it. When you're a superstar in a fatal four-way match for a coveted WWE championship, or to be number one contender, or just to settle a score, there are times you could be in there... And how's this going on? How's the official missing this? This capacity crowd is beside itself. That should do it. In case you're keeping score, that's twice, Byron. This might be it. Clearly on a mission here. Now it's time to capitalize. When we talk about fatal four-way matches, and Corey, you mentioned this before, everyone is battling for themselves. Alliances are fleeting, and a rivalry can be conceived or renewed at any time. There are instances when friends have to battle one another if they are to achieve everything they want to in sport. That'll have to be worrying about long-term injuries for sure. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Digging deep for a kick out. Can you believe this? Oh, that was a vicious shot. Tremendous ring presence from the apron. Toss to the outside. Big time move. I don't know how much more of this he can take. And things look bleak right now. Look at this, so damaging. This one's over, guys. Cover here. One. You can't teach the type of tenacity we're witnessing here. Unreal. Wow. I thought for sure that was it. Back in the ring again. Going all the way up. Perfectly executed. Something that a superstar must remember in a fatal four-way match is that there are no count-outs and no disqualifications. I love the sound. Big move coming. Wait for it. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Back between the ropes. Oh boy, he is rolling. Real close, too close for cover. What a match. He's making a statement here with this attack. Look, at, there's no coming back from that. This one is oak shoulders on the mat. Broken up, and the match continues. move after the other. It's devastating. Look out. Moonbreaker. What a comeback. Looking for all the glory here. Two. Well, that was a close call. Wow, I thought this was over. What an amazing display of athleticism.
these competitors trying to keep their wits about them. Don't blink, folks. You might miss something here in this fatal four-way match. Under the rules here, the first superstar to get a pin or submission will be our winner. Should be a great one. And the DDT! The knee drop lands. Allow me to take you back to December 7, 2015 and one of the largest matches in WWE history. The Fatal 4 Way Tag Team Eliminator. And the cover for the win! And a kick out. Yeah, this early, no chance. That lands. We know what's coming here. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. That's how you put an exclamation. And will this be it? Byron, the fatal four-way tag team elimination match that you spoke of earlier was certainly an exciting way to help close out 2015. The WWE Universe knew to forget what they thought they knew about tag team matches when both Usos were going to superplex Rusev and Braun Strowman into the ring and powerbomb both Usos as they superplex Rusev. Michael, that was an unbelievable display of power by the monster among men, Braun Strowman. And soon after, there were bodies flying everywhere. Tommy Dreamer eliminated the Wyatt family, the League of Nations took out Team ECW, and Roman Reigns brought down Sheamus with a spear to give his team the victory. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. What a match! That could break a nose. At the 33rd WrestleMania in Orlando, Florida, the Raw Tag Team Championship was decided in a fatal four-way ladder match. It was champions Anderson and Gallows, Cesaro and Sheamus, Enzo and Cass, and looking at it here, seen and heard tonight there must be serious injuries uh, I think this is the beginning of the end Corey the fatal four-way tag match at Wrestlemania was one of the most anticipated contests on the card the Hardy Boys shocked the world when they returned to the grandest stage of them all once they displayed their trademark continuity it was like they never left but Gallows and Anderson were not giving away the title the teams were in top form and were not afraid it's got to be hard to rebound from that one that has got to be it And a powerful kick. Twist of fate. One. Oh, somehow. Not yet. Going for the cover. What is keeping this competitor going? Uh uh. Oh, going to the top. High risk. Oh boy, he is rolling. Ow, that hurt. You have to possess a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. The human body can only absorb so much of that. We're witnessing, we got a call. A short testament to grit. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. Big move. Clearly on a mission here. Game, set, match. This one is over. Cover here. One, two, three. 
What a fatal four-way victory. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. And it's for the ECW United States Championship. Guys, while exciting, we have to remember that triple threat matches are incredibly dangerous. Especially when a two-on-one attack takes place, which is inevitably going to happen at some point here tonight, Michael. And his opponents, first, from New York, weighing in at 315 pounds, the Superstar. Guys, we have triple threat action coming up as three of WWE's top superstars are set to square off. And Michael, I can realistically envision any one of these three competitors having their hand raised in victory here tonight.
Big time singles matches on deck here. And Byron, what should we expect to see here tonight? Well, given the shape these superstars appear to be in here tonight, I fully expect to see one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. Triple threat action underway now. Face. Jumping face Burn. buster. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. That slam put him in a bad way, guys. Inside the ring now. Not the first time we've seen this move tonight. He's on the defensive here. He can't rest on his laurels here. There are two other guys in there that want this match just as much as he does. This thing appears to be slipping away from him in a hurry, guys, and you can bet he envisioned things going much differently for him heading into this match. That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. That shot hit the opponent exactly in the right spot. What accuracy. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oof. It's always important to get off to a strong start in a match. It's even more important to do that in a triple threat match, given that you're going up against two opponents at the same time. Add to that the no disqualification stipulation, and there's little to no room for error. One mistake, and it can cost you a lot more than winning the match. Byron, you spoke about this before. A competitor must do everything they can do to start things off on the right foot in a triple threat match. One way to do that is to target one of your opponents and go after them as soon as the bell rings. You're battling two opponents at the same time, so it's hunt or be hunted. And that's what I like, Michael. It's survival of the fittest. There's a pin now. Look at this. Oh, boy, he is rolling. This match might be over, guy. We've got a cover. This battle's not over yet. Still too fresh. The back of the head taking quite a punishment here. He's looking a little off balance. If he's not careful, this can snowball out of control for him in a hurry. In a back and forth match like this, he has to do everything in his power not to let his opponent gain too much momentum here. Oh, and he reverses it. Oh, no. We know what this 
is. People have been wanting to see these guys go at it for a long time, and by the sound of this crowd, I think they're getting what they wanted. You don't nice. Shut it down. Oh my god, a clothesline. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. He's making a statement here with this attack. This might be it. How are these superstars even still going, guys? I mean, they have to be on fumes right now. A oh, stop in the leg! Just nasty. He's fading fast. And I'm not sure he even knows where he is. You know what? It's pretty remarkable that he's even still in this match. I mean, he's taking quite a beating, but he's still in there refusing to give up. What a hellaciously physical match these gladiators have put themselves through. The intensity of this has been incredible. This could end it in a hurry. Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. F5! Thunderous! That should do it. Oh, scoop slam! Unleashing it for the second time now. Oh boy, he is rolling. The Florida Keys! Ooh, going for the cover. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. You can't teach the type of tenacity we're witnessing here. Unreal. I can't believe what we're seeing here. We know and a savage clothesline. And there it is, boys. It's just a matter of time now. That has got this could do it. Two. Three. And the triple threat is over. This place is going nuts! A few times. Epic. Here is your winner, and still, ECW United States Champion, the unpredictable Haas Ann. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a very big win here tonight. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. With that win in the books, we must now move on.